Nobody loves indies better. Here's Comic Book Man and Bo. Child, he gonna mess your ass up. Independent Comic Book News, Episode 65, Detroit Dunkledge. Hey folks, how you doing? Comic Book Man here. Welcome once movie? again to my video on house. It's time for... Indie News. Indie News. And Indie News is brought to you from Alternate Reality. Located at the intersection of 111 and Kedzie in beautiful downtown Mount Greenwood. Yeah. Alternate Reality, your own comics for 15% off every day, including all my image and all my Aspen comics. This oh, is an nice all image and Aspen comics. <laughs> I think this is a first. I don't think we've ever done like an no, Aspen we've never, heavy. No, no we've no. never. No, well, Aspen has been... Nine times out of ten, when Aspen shows up at conventions, they just announced stuff that we knew like six months ago. Yeah. They actually started announcing stuff that actually was going to happen. But this is an all-image and all-Aspen comics update, and it's very Aspen heavy. Uh, but up first, though, it's is... It's heavy what? Aspen heavy. Ah. Up first is this. Robert Kirkman's The Walking Dead. I, they made a they made a something out of this thing. I forget Kirkman's what it is. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, does it involve zombies? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it involves oh. zombies. And yes, it was on AMC. And you're about as subtle as a brick in the head. Damn, I missed it. Well, okay. uh, it'll be turned into a series of novels in the early 2011. You mean book books? Book books. Actual oh. books, you know, books that have pages and not art in them. No actual, you know, words, just words, no you pictures. Mean, you mean I gotta read them? Yes, you'll actually have to read them. Kirkman's going to do the outlines, he's going to write the plots, but he will not be writing the actual books. Jay Barasinha will write the books. The novels will feature characters that are not in the series anymore, so if you're a comic book fan and you read the comic and you want to know what happened to specific characters, you'll have to buy the books. Uh, I assume it's going to be in continuity? No. These are It'll be out of continuity? These are characters that basically at some oh, point completely and totally disappeared in the book, and you go, well, what the hell ever happened to them? And then they'll go, oh, that's what happened to them. Yeah, but, but it'll be in continuity. But the characters it'll, will not be, be popping back up in the comic, even though they were in the books. Okay. Okay. Uh, next up. Hey, remember this? Nobody does anymore. Guess what, guys? What you, the hell was that? You lost all your juice on this sucker a long time ago. But you know what? They haven't finished it up yet, so the day will come when the last couple of issues trickle out, right. just like an old man's pee standing over the toilet at 4 in the morning. How's that for an image for you? <laughs> as far as they can figure, Image United number 4 will be out by the end of the year, which means, What's remember that time of the year when they ship all the independent books around Christmas time? Because yeah. they want to get everything We're coming out? right into that right Well, now. Image United number 4, probably one of those books. Uh, image number... Number five and six will be out before summer, they think. <laughs> so this is kind of like the Image 10th anniversary hardcover, which took two years to get done. And that, it's all on Todd McFarlane's image, desk. Image, <laughs> image started out their life doing this. Yeah. And you know what? It's 15 years, 16... No, we're coming up on 20 years next year. We're getting pretty we? close to the yeah, big anniversary. We're coming up on the big 20th anniversary. You know what? Not a damn thing has changed. changed it's thing. absolutely amazing. It's absolutely amazing. How they're still in business is beyond me. Uh, <laughs> Scott LaBelle. Well, Scott yeah. LaBelle was actually working on a five-issue limited Oops, series for Image called The Butler. Uh, basically this is Soulfire. That, no, well, that's because Soulfire is the next story. <laughs> I said there was no graphic for the butler about 20 minutes ago. Uh, he'll be writing a five-issue limited series for Image called The Butler. It's called a tease. <laughs> Basically, The Butler will be about let's, Jarvis. Yeah, Jarvis has been in the Avengers yeah. Mansion for about 30 years. Yeah, Alfred. Yeah, you know, So basically, oh, someone will show up, and he's time. always there when a new team is formed. Yes. Well, the team that's in the, the team that's in the mansion at this point, silver. they'll go bad. Which and team rogue. is this? This will be a brand new team. Well, it's a team that he's going to invent. It's not a, an actual team. It's from Image. They don't have teams. They can't even get Image United four out on time. We're the servers. Would you care if it's But what will happen is these 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 new heroes will take over the UN, and the only person who can save us from other damnation is the Butler. The Butler. Yeah. Save us from the Butler. Save Butler. us from the Butler. How many trees did we just kill doing that story? None. We don't kill any trees. None. And this is recycled paper. We don't kill trees. Hey, you've never seen this before, have you? No, nah, here uh, you go. Meanwhile, over at Aspen. Where did that come from? <laughs> over at Aspen, Soulfire is coming up on a third volume? The third volume? Yes, the second volume is just about done, and they're going to be announcing a third volume. Now, writer JT Krull has a DC exclusive, but he's still yes. allowed to write Soulfire because 
He's already written all of the third volume, and so it doesn't really violate his contract. Did Jeff Johns co-create so far? Jeff Johns was there. Mike he does Curry something at DC, doesn't he? Yes, Jeff Johns does <laughs> stuff. He, what is he doing? Perhaps there? that's why. You know what? Perhaps he, that's he, why Cruel is still working on Soulfire. Well, that could be. And he, he said he says the books are already written, and they're being drawn right now. The third volume of the series will focus on the characters Malachi and Grace. You'll also see the return of the villain scene in the first series, Onyx. 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 Scary. If you pick up Executive Assistant Irish, you Which may Which is have, a book that never ships on time. You may have been... Well, none of these books ship on time. Uh, if you pick up Executive Assistant Irish, though, you probably asked yourself, are there more Executive Assistants why out there? Why am I reading that? <laughs> <laughs> Who's paying? Oh, because I know. Oh, pretty art. Oh, I know why you're reading it. <laughs> because Look, of the pretty Right art. there. That's one reason, and that's another reason. Oh, and if you go down south the ways, there's another reason. <laughs> Let me zoom in on you go, If you go south to the land of cotton, oh there's there's another reason. But anyway, you may have been asking yourself, beyond why am I reading this, uh, are there other executive assistants out there? And they're going to answer that question. Yes, because not only is executive assistant Iris going to come back in the summertime, but we're going to yes. be introduced to executive assistants Rose and Vinny. What about Irene? <laughs> Irene's, uh, Irene's in 2012. <laughs> Irene's in 2012. They, they come up with chrysanthemum, but they could spell Chrysanthemum is 2013. Right. We talked before about Scott Lobdell and the butler. He's also at Aspen doing the fourth volume of <laughs> Yes, they're on the fourth volume of Phantom. He'll be starting the fourth volume, yes. Volume yeah. three is going to end. He is signed on to do the next two years of uh, the character Fathom. He doesn't plan on using any of the supporting cast seen before, yeah. and he'll introduce you to new people and locations. Yeah. And as far as we know, uh, that Fox chick is still playing her in the movie, which James Cameron is supposed to be executive producing. The Fox chick? Yes, uh, Megan, Megan Fox. Yeah, oh. Megan Fox. She's still going to be swimming and walking around in a bikini and stuff. So. Great. And that means you'll have a lot more Fathom stuff. As long as she and that's the main reason people buy Fathom. <laughs> she she's in a bikini, and she's wearing a thong, and she floats around in the water. She needs a screenplay. She does? Yes, look hey, at that look comic. at that ass. She can crack walnuts to that butt. Look at that ass. She can crack some walnuts to that thing. Showing us her best side. Anyway, that's oh, it. Oh, you see the so, now that we've pandered as much as we possibly can to... That's not to, pandering. That's basically talking to your audience. We're done. We're finished. We're out of here. We've got no more indie news. But you can go to the store's website and check out all the indie news that Bo sends me that I post up. And where's the store's website at? Sarah knows. Sarah does know. www.marletonetreality.com It changes almost every day. Unlike on the book man and his socks. So stop off at the store's website, check out all his news, and until next time, this is Comic Book Man. And Bo. Saying. 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 Say it. Say it. So long you do this. We got, we got time. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 waiter. Bye. <laughs>